Hey, Javier, how are you? Hey, what's up? How are you? I'm fine. Good. How was your day? Ah, man. So tired. <laughs> when the, when the, the end of the month, all the end of the month, mm -hmm. are really, I have many activities to do. So that's what I, I feel so, so weak, so tired, sleepy eyes. You say you're ready to finish, huh? I'm ready. This is the last class, right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's pretty good. It's the last class. It's the end of the month. Tomorrow you get a chance to go to bed early or relax or, you know, do something different. This is the problem. When I have the time. I spend the time in other things, and I always, I'm awakened. Uh -huh, okay. So what do you do when you're not in class? Um, maybe we'll watch TV or play uh, video games. Video games? What video games do you like? Uh, it's a mobile, Call of Duty. Oh, uh, mobile. Yeah. Okay. All right. Do you like video games too? I do. I, I I don't have a lot of time to play, but I like video games. I used to play some video games. Mm -hmm. When when you were younger or now? No, 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 no. Not. My son has a PlayStation or he had a PlayStation 4 and we played sometimes uh, Mortal Kombat or a few others, um, Call of Duty and things like that. But no, no, no. I think... For me, is I don't like. I, I I prefer the old games, the ones where you fight or you do something. I, I really like those games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I play. I played uh, Nintendo, and I really love one game uh, called uh, Killer Instinct. It was a black uh, cassette. And it was very good. I, I think so, too. I like those old games because I feel like what, me, when I was young, I used to go to the to the machines and I used to play. And I, <laughs> I play machines, too. <laughs> that was my... When I, when I went to, to, to buy the food for, to, to my mama cock, mm -hmm. uh, I stayed playing like 30 minutes. <laughs> and exactly. And... <clears throat> It's amazing. One quarter, two. <laughs> it's a long time. A long time. A long time. Nico, what about you? What do you do to relax? What are your favorite hobbies? Mm, well, I like to listen to music. I guess that's the best way for me to relax. Do you and I also like read. dance, karaoke? What? Um, well, I like to dance and I, and I, I also like to sing and I can sing. But I, I know the lyrics of many songs, so I okay. like to sing them. Like, like what? What kind of music you like to sing? Well, all of them. I, I'm really like all the genres. I I like rock. I like pop. I like reggae. I like reggaeton. I like wow. salsa. Yeah, I know the lyrics of many songs. Anna said about Anna said that when she talked about me. Because when we are at work and we are playing music, I used to sing all the songs. Okay. So do you ever go out and you say, hey, today's karaoke night. Today, <clears throat> I'm going to show Not you. Not really. No. <laughs> Not really. I don't do that. Because <laughs> okay. I don't know. I, I mean, I like to sing, but I can't sing. So I don't do it like that much in public. And I guess there's not many places that have like the karaoke option for you to go there. Okay. Okay. No problem. Well, you know, I got to be like Unico. I can't sing. I'm horrible. It sounds like a cat. It's me. But I don't care. <laughs> uh huh. But I sing in my house. <laughs> not exactly. In public. That's what it's all about. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Well, I see we're getting a couple other people in. We're just going to wait a few moments to make sure that everybody logs in um, and take a look at our day. Right now, Carlos, 
Anna, I see that you logged in as well. How are you? How was your day? Hi, teacher. Uh, hey, sir. <laughs> okay. So we're just going to take a few minutes, five minutes quickly, talk about your day, your plans. What are you going to be doing today? Um, you know, how was your day? What happened? It's the end of the month. So usually, oof. There's a lot of things to get done or for tomorrow, a lot of activities that have to be prepared. And then we come back and work on our final exam and make sure everything is clear, okay? Okay, guys, so are we ready? We're all set? Yes? Okay, I saw in the WhatsApp group, a couple people will not be able to make it. Unfortunately, it's usually, you know, there's always something at the end of the month. So that's the, the little bit of a hard part sometimes for some people. Um, in this moment, we're gonna go ahead and proceed. 
as you recall, yesterday we were talking about a few parts of the exam. Uh, we had five different parts that we were looking at. Let me share one more time. Let's try that again there. Okay, here we have part A, B, C, D, and E. All of the parts are a little bit different, starting with the listening part in A. There are two types of listening. It joining the sentence by using the correct defining or non-defining. Also, we corrected a few mistakes from yesterday. Some people, they had a few issues. Remember for some of them, it's which, um, not only that, also there can be where. Here, you use the words that are given in order to answer it. Choose the correct word or the best word to complement the sentences, both at the beginning and at the end. And the final part right here is the reading, where you read and answer the questions, if it's true or false, based on the information for there. Okay. Uh, before we begin, is there anybody that already finished? Anybody that said, ah, I did it before? Um, I just have issues with part B. Um defining i think is the number one it got it wrong i don't know why only number one javier i thought i think number three was the problem in no. uh, just okay. copy the all the sentence and 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 add the information okay okay all right so just that one yeah and, and the rest is finished javier uh, yeah yeah okay all right good anybody else uh, I'm having issues in the part B with the number one and the number four. I get Same. them wrong. The number so one I don't one know and what the, the issue four. is. Mm -hmm. mm, all, all, all the rest is good for me. Okay. But just those two sentences that I don't know what, what the issue is with them. Okay. okay. Yeah, me too. Anna, you finished also? Yes, yes. Okay. I only got that part wrong too. All right, great. Nelson and Carlos, did you guys finish? Yes. Okay, great. I'm Nelson. still working on it. Okay. That, that's yeah, right. part, part A is done, part C is done, part D is done, part B is the one that I'm working on it because I was doing the rest of the part, so using the cell phone, which is mm. easy, I will say. Uh -huh. uh, the part B, I think that it was it is easier working from the computer, so I'm finishing that from the site. Okay, okay. Well, let's go ahead and take a look. Um, let's. I'll give you a few moments, uh, Nelson, and then we'll come back. So, since most of you are are finished or almost finished, we'll take a few moments um, just for Nelson to wrap up, for the others to share their answers, and let's say ten minutes. I think ten minutes is enough for that last little part, and then we can come and check the answers and correct the parts where mm, there was an issue maybe in the platform and not in your answers, okay? All right, great. Let's go.
Okay, guys, great to have you back. Let's clarify those doubts or those issues. Um, first things first, in the listening, Thomas arrived in Chile yesterday. In this part uh, with Kathy and Thomas, any question, was everything okay? Everything's okay. Okay, good. Remember, feel free to ask, don't worry. Um, that's the idea because today's the last day, so you have to have completed 80% or more. Here, I remember, Javier, you mentioned number one, is that right? Well, yeah. Okay, and what did you put for number one? Um, I was not uh, using the correct word, but I fixed it now. Oh, okay, okay, so you got it? Yeah, I got it. Okay, and what was the word that you had? Uh, I was using which. Oh, it, it should be that, right? That, right, exactly. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look. Bulgaria is a small country that is cheap to travel in by bus. Mm -hmm. Good, okay. Um, I think number two, Nicole, you said you had problems with number two? No, I'm having trouble with number four. Number two, it's correct for me. Okay, great. So number two, we have a couple of different ways to answer it. Uh, all of those are correct. You just have to be careful with the commas. When you use that, it's not a comma, which you're going to have two commas, one before and one after. And then, of course, over here as well, where we just have Florence, and then you go directly to uh, the same thing all the way up to foot. So which is a small city or which is it easy to navigate on foot. Okay. And it is correct to don't use comma when you are using that. In this case, yes, because that is essential information, not extra information. Okay. So the extra information is a small city, but we are not, that is part of the first sentence. So we don't use a comma here because if we eliminate this, is not a context. It's like a taco. A taco is a small city, but it doesn't tell us anything. So when it's necessary that extra information, that's why no comma. Okay, sounds different too. It is, it is that because here you have a little bit different information that is involved in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Number three, as you can see is my hometown. We have two different ways. We have the one where we get the comma before and after the which, and the same thing here. Only the difference is what information you put in. Both of them are extra, which is a popular tourist destination or which gets crowded in the summer. But those are the two forms that are correct. Nicole, for you, number four, we can have two forms as well. Here, take a look compared to the one that you had and see if what it could be the mistake. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Did you find a mistake, Nicole? Yes, thank you. Okay, great. Okay. Anybody else for part B? Any questions? No? Okay, great. What about part C? Part C where it was complete the sentences? Anybody that uh, had some issues or difficulty with this part? Great, so that we, everybody got that one right as well. Nice. Uh, section D, choosing the correct complement or the correct um, initial part. Okay. 
Wow. wow. All right. So then just the last part, the reading. Any questions about the reading, vocabulary, expressions, or any of the answers that were not clear? Woo. All right. So I guess that means that we are complete. Excellent. All right, guys. So before we go on, uh, let's make sure that we are clear. Anybody have any questions? Something that mm, during the platform or during the class is still a little confusing or everything is okay? Okay, I assume that means that we are good to go. Very great. All right, so because today is our last day, in the chat here, in the chat from the class, you can see a link. That link is to help you create and have several different questions for a conversation, okay? With your partner, we're gonna make a few groups. With our partners, it's super easy. What we want to do is talk a little bit about those different topics. We can choose whatever topic is interesting for you, okay? So if you say, oh, you know, maybe mm, amusement park, I want to talk about. My friend says, oh, birthday, that's fine. The idea is the next part is just for us to have a conversation, talk a little bit, use our vocabulary and the grammar that we've learned in this class. It's okay? Yes. Okay, remember, open up the window because when you go to the groups, always there's a tendency to it. The message is erased. All right, let's go to our groups and choose whatever topic for you is interesting. That way you can have an idea to express yourself better.
Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, George. I'm going Today to Today is our last class, right, teacher? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to share with you a link. Is in the link in the chat. Uh-huh. Okay. We're going to take a few minutes to talk with our partner about any topic from the link, and then we're going to come back and discuss it together. George, did you okay. finish the exam? Did you finish? I finished everything. Okay. Uh, teacher, Perfect. I just want—I just want to apologize because, to, to be honest with you, when I when I when I uh, I was looking to join a, a class, I was mm -hmm. looking to join a class starting at 9 p.m. But for mm -hmm. some reason, uh, uh, the, the the company didn't open that group, so they recommend me to to join at eight. But it's impossible for me because I am always driving from 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 work, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's the reason I, I I haven't been able, you know, to to be focused on the classes. And I just want to apologize. It is not that that that, that I don't like it. It is more than that that I can't. So I will not continue on the next model. But it, but it is because of that because because I can't from eight to nine, um, so I just just wanna apologize with you. That's okay, George. Um, when they there's always an email, um, the connection and, and right that if if for you you need nine o'clock, tell them because they create a list. And no, then, I did. I did. Oh, okay. So, they, so what they say is that they when when you open a class at nine they, they, at nine p.m. they will let me know. Exactly. Doesn't matter but, if it is at advanced uh, one, two, or three. I I I remember there are three different levels, right? Correct. So Correct. they told me that they will let me know. Okay. Well, it's unfortunate, but you know, if it's difficult for you, you have to do what is best, and the best is. To yeah, that no, because to be honest, to be honest with you, it, it is a waste of time having the class at A because I can't, you know, concentrate myself. It, yeah. it, so, you know, I, it is it is a waste of time. I imagine that minimum 30, 40 minutes, you you lose the class because you are concentrating and driving and other things. Yeah. Okay. So that's the reason. So maybe we 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 can join in the future. You know, to uh, in a group at nine p.m. to ten p.m. Right. Yeah. But I finished everything at the platform, teacher. Excellent. Well, great job, George. I'm glad. It's important because that way they give you the scholarship again. That way you finish, that's, okay, that's correct. finish, and then when they open, you have the opportunity to continue at that time. Yeah. So I will. I will be joining today. Just you know, just to mark the the attendance. <laughs> but, but 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 I really want to apologize with you. No and, and let you know what was the reason that I was not you know focused on the classes. It was because of that. Okay, okay. Thank you for explaining and I completely understand. Now I understand. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, George, I'm going to join you with the partners. Mm -hmm. so that way you have at least the last day to talk a little bit and then we come back. Okay, sure. All right, great. Let me send you to the group. Don't know what happened, teacher. Okay, I'll try again. One more. It says there. I'm not sure. Let me try the other class there.
All right. I hope you had a nice conversation with your partners. We had a couple ideas. This is our last moment together. We only have a few moments left. Um, so tell me, what are your plans? What do you normally do when you don't have class? So beginning tomorrow, poof, you can go to sleep early, watch TV, waste time, be on TikTok. I don't know. What are you going to do? Read a book, just practice a hobby. What are you going to do? Well, I think that I will try to go to sleep early because like sometimes in class I'm literally dying because I feel like really tired. And I will try also to use a little bit more my phone because I, when I'm at work and can't use it at all, just when I'm on breaks or at lunch. So I will try to go to sleep earlier because these days have been hard. Okay, I can imagine. I can imagine what, you know, that's that shows that it's really a sacrifice for you. And I congratulate you because, you know, sometimes it's difficult sacrifices and enjoy enjoy going to bed early for two weeks because then you begin again. <laughs> Okay, perfect. What about you, Javier? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, are you talking about the different things that I do when I'm not on class? Correct. Uh, I usually after I can I can work. Uh, I went to play basketball Fridays. Mm -hmm. uh, I I went to to sing. Sing to a bar. Yeah. Like Nicole. Yeah. yeah. I, sometimes okay. I, I do it. And Saturday, maybe weekends is when I usually spend more time doing that. And listening music. Okay, so when you go to the bar to sing, do you do karaoke? Uh, sometimes when I have to sing or when people tell me that to sing an, a song that I really don't know exactly the lyrics, I use it. But usually I have a playlist that I sing several times and I know the lyrics in Spanish and English too. Wow. I love a, a song uh, of Toto. It's called uh, it's called name Hold the Line. Okay. And I love and I love Tears for Fears and Nirvana and different kind of groups. I think Nicole maybe knows the lyrics. Ah, so I let's know move. for Hold the Line. I Do like you know? it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, when the song starts makes you makes you different you, you you want to to dance or something something like that it's it really takes cool. you to another place for real yeah it's so beautiful it's a nice song you see the two of you have the same hobbies time to go to karaoke tomorrow okay just, just <laughs> give me a <laughs> okay. okay george what about you what do you do when you're not in english class Mm, well, I, I I do have a kid teacher. Uh, he is five years old. So mm -hmm. when when I when I when I come, it is when I come or when I came. No, when, when, when I, I come home. Mm -hmm. When I come home, so I usually spend time with with him. You know, uh, doing some homeworks, um, uh, um, uh, learning, uh, learning together. You know, uh. The, the, the vocabulary, the numbers, learning, you know, to read books. So that's what I usually do. Well, actually, I just recently bought a Nintendo Switch. So just, you know, to play with him as well. So I, I bought this, this Mario Kart. I haven't played since the Nintendo 64. So that's what I usually do uh, when, when I come home, uh, spend time with, with my kids. And what do you think? Do you like Nintendo Switch? Yeah, uh, I just have the, the Mario Kart. And actually, I just, uh, I, I, I bought the, the Mario Kart uh, today's Tuesday. It was on Sunday. 
so I only have play for you know from Sundays in to in, in Monday in today. So, but but it's but it's good. I, I I really recommend it. Okay, no, and I imagine for your son is amazing when they are five years old. Ah, ah, let's play, let's play. Oof, that is yeah, the life. And actually, the switch has uh, <clears throat> uh how do you say uh, uh como un modo a, a mode where for for kids especially. You know that the car is drive itself, so he just need to move the the control to 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 move it, you know, to the right or to the left. So it's very easy for for kids to to you know to learn. Okay, that's pretty cool. Because yeah, that way they don't have a lot of mistakes. If you die or you do others, it makes it easier for yeah. them. They don't need to you know be pressing the the different buttons, so they just need to have control of the of the of the the control right all right mm -hmm. cool all right pretty nice well enjoy the time with your son starting tomorrow yeah i will thank you you're welcome all right nelson what about you what did what do you normally do when you're not in class well it depends on what day are we talking about but uh, usually I will say, ha, just like George, I do a battle with online friends. I play Switch as well. Or then I get together with some friends sometimes uh, not to play Switch. In that case, we play different games. <laughs> sometimes we play board games. We drink. Sometimes I just go eating somewhere. They are, and despite what Although I understand that human beings is, is a person that is, is, is a being that is look, that looks for society, I will say. I enjoy the solitude, I will say. So sometimes I just want to be alone. So I just go and spend some time reading a book and drinking a good cup of coffee. So it depends. It depends on my mood, depends on the date itself. That's what I do. All right. I well, don't watch good. that much TV. Perhaps uh, that's that's something that I could do, but I don't actually watch that much TV. I only use the TV usually to play video game, game games, and uh, from time to time, perhaps there is an anime or one series that I want to watch. But I still, even though I do have Netflix, HBO, Amazon, all those streaming services, I got it more for the fact that we do it together with friends basically i pay for hbo they pay for amazon someone else pay for netflix mm. and we all share the accounts so we all have those avail availabilities available for us but i don't actually watch those many series and even when i do it i will say i have it on netflix i only watch one episode a day <laughs> okay well that's good it's good that you read and you have other hobbies most people love to watch TV or spend time on that, but I see you also like video games, which seems to be part of the group, right? This class, a lot of people like to play a few video games. That's nice too. I see that we have singers as well. That's awesome. Yeah. We should get together. I don't sing though. Oh, well, I do sing for my own, <laughs> for my own entertainment because I sing, I sing pretty bad. So <laughs> I, I won't okay. say that I do, but we can do it and you can make fun of me and then you will enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, no. I, I'm horrible. I'm really bad at singing. But <laughs> hey, when you go for fun with friends, it doesn't matter. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perhaps Javier and, and Nicole can teach us to give us a little free exactly, lesson how exactly. to sing. Javier, Javier can start <laughs> off with the playlist. <laughs> yeah, it sounds Javier. like a pretty good playlist. Like a, a classic one with Toto on it. The best music. <laughs> All right, Carlos, what about you? Tell me, what are you going to be doing? Well, in my case, I see the news with my parents. And also, if they are seeing uh, and sort of periods, I see it, but I don't know what the, is about the, the, the sort of period. But I love uh, to share time with, with them. Uh, we also have a conversation, um, uh, discuss problem or something that happened with some of, 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 of us. And also I play video games too. 
Uh, I play for uh, for three hours, maybe uh, all all days, <laughs> and that's my hobby. What video games do you like, Carlos? Well, I play Fortnite with my friends, mm -hmm. and also I play the uh, Battlefield. It's a war game. Yeah. Uh, it's called. I play it online. Yeah. Well, I, I play that, those games uh, due to the online mode. Okay, cool. Well, you know, if, if you really have, a, it's, it's really almost like socializing, like playing sports, because before you had to go play basketball or soccer, and now everybody, hey, hey, hey I'm going to connect. Let's connect tomorrow at this time, and do, 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 is the social, is that you connect yes. online and you play together. <laughs> yes. Okay. Good. Selena, what about you? What is going to happen starting tomorrow? Hello, teacher. My, my hobby is uh, watch TV. <laughs> I love watch TV. But I like to dance. Uh, mm. I dance uh, all kinds of music. And I think that, that the dance um, helped me to 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 forget the problem, the, the the all the responsibility of my work, and I like that. <laughs> but but I I didn't um, take the class, but I try to dance. <laughs> okay, I I like to go to the party, and I go I go to with my friends. And sometimes we only we only talk and we only take a, a coffee. I love dessert, <laughs> but but uh, I have to do a exercise, you know. But now I I didn't, and that it is uh, something I know that. I have to do that because um, um, some two years ago, I went to the gym, but um, for the pandemic, I didn't. I didn't go, and it's for that that I want to to try again. And. Uh, but it's hard to me because it's uh, the, the, the schedule of my work is so hard and, and sometimes I can't. And now I take a, a class, an English class, <laughs> and, and I can't too. And it's too difficult to, to have a time for, for my hobby and my job. Difficult. Okay, I understand. I understand. Hey, but now a little bit more time beginning to move. Now you can use the hour to go to the gym. Okay, I can hear you very well because I am uh, outside. Can you repeat? It's okay, Celine. It's okay. I say now you have okay. the hour to go to do other activities, but okay, no problem. No problem. <laughs> Thank you, teacher, and thank you for your passion. And I learned so much. And I, my partner helped me too. And yeah, great I partners. Said, thank you. Thank yeah. you. You're welcome. What about you, Anna? Tell us what's going to what are you going to do? Oh, you guys, these days have been tough because like I go to school, for example, today. On Tuesday and Thursday is just like the hardest because I have school from 4.50 to 8 p.m. And then at 8 p.m. we have this class. It ends at 9. I get home like, like 9.40 and I, I don't want to do anything anymore. Like I barely have dinner and then I like do my night routine and go to sleep. So these days that we're going to have, you know, a little um, time off, I'm going to be able to have like dinner while watching a, like a Netflix show, I guess. 
I'm watching The Office. So like that's a good one because it's like the episodes are short. You can watch just one and you finish your dinner. And then if I have homework, because for, for example, sometimes we have homework that um, today's Tuesday and it's due on Thursday. So I will be able to do my homework like at eight, let's say after I had a little me time and then at eight, I can do it. And then at 10, I can go to sleep. But like, for example, today I have homework that is due at 11 and I need to do it like when I get home. So I'm going to have a little bit more time. So to, right now, Anna, you're not at home right now. You're at the office. I'm at the office. Yes. I came back from La Gavidia to Concentrix and I'm mm -hmm. going to take the bus from here to my house. Yes. Wow. Very late. Because the, yeah, because the bus sometimes in some in some communities the bus stop at eight o'clock or something. So yeah, mm -hmm. there's transportation here from Concentrics. So I don't take like the normal route. Oh, okay, okay. Uh -huh, yes, they have the like, work a, bus. Okay. like a bus. Okay, mm -hmm. all right, great. Well, guys, I have to say it's been a pleasure to have you. Thank you so much for making the sacrifice to connect to class. I know it's not easy, so I congratulate you. And I hope that we continue again. Enjoy your small vacation a little, but a little vacation helps you to <laughs> relax. And then yes. we'll begin again in a few weeks. Okay? Okay. All, All right. right. Thank you so much. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you, guys. See you. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Take care. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Take care. Bye-bye.